but I never thought I'd be saying this. I never actually thought I'd be saying it because I thought, you know what, I'm young, I'm fit, like, I will not get this virus. And I ended up getting it. <laughs> this is not a joke. I would not joke about a subject like this. You guys read the title. Yes, I tested positive for COVID. Ah. And just before we get into the video, I just want to quickly say that I am not making this video for clout, for you guys to feel sorry for me. Anything to do with like that topic, I'm literally making this video to make you guys aware that this is still an actual crisis that's going on in the world. Because I feel like now beaches and everything and stuff's like opening up, everybody's like really eased off, people are going to parties and stuff, but nah. I was being very selfish, like, but it's literally completely my fault. You know, I shouldn't have gone to somewhere where I knew that it could have been exposed. So how it happened was I actually went to a friend's house who didn't actually feel great. But later, like the next day, we found out that she tested positive for it. Um, but obviously, we didn't know that on that day, so it's not her fault. But And then when she told me that she tested positive, I actually booked in a test for the next day. But on that next day, I actually felt ill. Like, straight away, I knew something was wrong with me. Like, my body was aching. And I had a sore throat. So when I got tested, I woke up this morning and yeah, I had a text after NHS saying that I had tested positive for COVID. It's not even a joke, man, this shit's not funny. But because of me being selfish, I have now affected like my family and some of my friends around me because a lot of people that I have been in touch with since, for obvious reasons, is not gonna go to work and they actually have to quarantine in the house for two weeks. And they obviously will lose out on a bit of money, but I'm making this video strictly because I want you guys to literally be self-aware that this is still a pandemic. We are still in a time that this virus is still here. You can still get it. It's still a thing. Like, I honestly can say I feel like shit. I have about five symptoms. My symptoms are sore throat, headache, my body's aching. I have a high temperature. I feel very tired. Um, like lethargic. <clears throat> oh, but now on a serious note, make sure you wear your masks when you're going to the shops, guys. Make sure you clean your hands on a regular basis because I was one of those people that wasn't doing those things. I used to actually go into the shops with my mask, but I never used to like wash my hands. I never used to like think about what other people are doing. And yeah, I was just very selfish to it. But obviously you live and you learn. I've learned my lesson. I'm going to be super, super clean everywhere I go from now on. I'm giving myself a good seven to 10 days to absolutely isolate and do nothing. And hopefully after those seven to 10 days, I'll come back negative i don't want you guys to feel sorry for me because this is completely my fault and i literally made this video because if i didn't make this video you guys would have figured out why i'm not leaving the house why i'm not filming videos outside why i'm not doing more stuff so i had to make this video to make you guys aware of obviously what i'm going through and the fact that you know this is still a real thing but yeah before i end this video let me know what i can do from home let me know if I can film any YouTube videos you guys want to see reacting to like old TikToks and I've done that already, but I'd happily do a part two. Um, Smash or pass part two could be a vibe. Yeah, honestly, just let me know what you guys want to see and I can definitely get it done in the next seven to ten days. But anyway, if you do feel sorry for me, <laughs> please smash that subscribe button. It might make me feel a little bit better. No, it will make me feel a little bit better. Uh, smash the like button. Leave a comment below because I've got so much time. I'm going to read all these comments. And yeah, guys, please make sure you stay safe. Stay safe. <laughs> Beep! Oh, my legs!